Every day, you live your life. You make sure you come straight home tonight. Ordinary. Normal. You know your mom, she gets like this sometimes. But there's only so long you can hide from the truth. So what is your pitch to somebody who hasn't read the book and might be a little skeptical of, oh, you know, is this another Twilight? Wow. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, I'm coming home! No, 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 you can't come home. You understand me? You don't come home. The werewolves and the vampires, we're not trying to recreate an image of that. That's not what this world is about. Like, whereas with Twilight, the world was about vampires. This is not about vampires. This is about... And I'm not choosing to become something that I'm not. I'm already a shadow hunter, and it's just my journey into figuring out who I am. I'm not uh, defined by romance, you know. Yes, there's a love cube, if you will, in this. Uh, it's very action-oriented, and it's, it's very much geared towards guys and girls. It's not just the story about a girl in between two guys. It's not just hitting the things that 14-year-old girls will like. It's more focused on the characters than just, like, the reason these books are popular is because the characters are beloved, not because the world and, you know, I think it's, it, the world exists around them, but like, like Lily said, it's, it's, the characters are really what people like about the book. If we need you, I need you. I never looked at this movie as a young adult movie. Uh, for me, it was a really interesting story, and I was inspired by The Exorcist, and Harry Potter and those amazingly beautiful visually worlds where you just get really scared. <laughs> I mean, the books are fantastic, but you will absolutely enjoy the movie without having read the book also. What is it about her? She's different. She's gonna get us all killed. All of these female-driven franchises, there's always the woman and then her two suitors. Um, well... Not when you're Lily Collins. There's usually <laughs> three, four, five oh of God. them waiting. And <laughs> waiting, in waiting, the wings. waiting in the wings. Waiting in the wings. Oh my god. And one of them's always interested in one of the guys, and then one of the girls is interested in one of the girls. And then I'm like, oh my god, what's going on? And it just gets really convoluted. <laughs> I don't actually know. It's a good question. I. I, guess I it's because, isn't it because like, you can't have evil. everything? Yeah, you can't always find one person that has all the qualities you want. You find the qualities in different people, and it, it's kind of like this journey of self-discovery that she's going on. She's not knowing what's right, what's wrong, what she likes, what she doesn't like. So having the two guys represents kind of the qualities that she likes in somebody, and it's kind of pulling her in both ways, but it's how she deals with them and gets through them that defines who she is. So there wouldn't be much of a choice if there was only one. The werewolves are here to save us. I never thought I'd say that.